Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. In this video, I explain to you how to block websites, using DNS Server Domain Controller, on Windows Server 2022. In the vast majority of organizations IT department officials, may be required to block access to certain websites, or in some places they are required, to block complete access to the internet. And in this video I am going to show you, how to block websites from our DNS, on Windows Server in a safe, and effective way. The reason we use DNS Server, to restrict access to certain sites is, because client computers query, and validate the primary DNS, so the changes we make there will be reflected, on the client computers. For example, if you want to prevent domain users, from accessing the Facebook page, on the client's computers. You will find here whether the Facebook site is working, and to prevent access to this site first, I will move again, to the domain server. Then, type DNS, in the search box, and from the search results, click on DNS app. And after opening the DNS manager application, to prevent access to certain sites, it will be necessary to create a new zone that points to the respective websites, so that the website can return the error, that the server did not find it because we will not create any host record, that points to the websites of the server destination. And to create this zone, right click on forward lookup zone, and from the menu, click on new zone. And then, click on the next button to continue, and in the zone type window, click on the next button, and leave the option as it is. Then, click on the next button to continue, and in this step type the name of the zone, here type the name of the site that you want, to prevent domain users from accessing but without www, and then click on the next button. Then, select the option, do not allow dynamic updates, and click on the next button, to continue. And finally click on finish. A new zone will immediately be created, with the name of the website, you want to block. Double click on the new zone. Then, right click on any empty area, and from the menu, click new host. In the new host window, enter a fake IP address that does not exist, for example 0.0.0.0, .0 then click on the add host button, and it will show you that the host's IP has been added, successfully. After that, open the command prompt, and type the command that appears in front of you on the screen, this command does the clear DNS cache. And then, go to the client's computer, to test the DNS server domain controller on the client's computer. Before anything, open the command prompt, and type the command that updates the group policy, or you can restart the client's computers, to apply the new policy to it. After that, try opening the Facebook website, open a new tab, and type the Facebook website address. It's already been banned. Try again to do a Google search, and open Facebook, you will find that it has been permanently banned. After that, you can go back to the domain server again, and you can block any website you want, in the same way. I hope the video is useful to you. And I thank you for watching. And I also hope to subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.